There's like two people. Well, no. So here I'm at Markela Powers from the 961st. Um, I was just taking off a fuel drain line that was leaking in flight on the way over here. And we're about to get it fixed. Uh, this is the second time we took it off. We took it off for troubleshooting. And this is the time we're taking it off to actually fix it since we have parts. Uh, the exercise has been great. We've made uh, almost every sortie, so it's been pretty good. Just major, well, inspections, after flight inspections, every time it comes down, we do a thorough inspection and find things that we fix on spot so we can make the next mission. I've learned how much the Air Force does. Like, we do a lot and we control, this plane controls a lot of the exercise. So. Um, First Lieutenant Levick Rao with the 961st AMU out of Kadena. Our uh, role of the E3 is to provide uh, command and control in the air, help control the fighters that are fighting and doing their fights in the sky for the exercise. Uh, it's just to make sure all the maintenance is accomplished on the aircraft and that it can go up there and do its mission. Uh, so our first crew show our, for our maintenance recovery, our launch team is around 03 in the morning, 2.30 in the morning, and then they'll probably leave depending on how much maintenance around noon or, or, or earlier, just depending on what's going on. And then recovery shift will come in around 11.30 or, or noon, and then depending on the maintenance, it go back, come back around 12 uh, or later, depending. So just depending on what maintenance di dictates. Communication with all entities on base, uh, host units and third parties, just making sure that plans are, are communicated clearly and well, and that we execute fast and, and move faster rather than slower and sooner rather than later just because it's a dynamic environment we're working in and the sooner we get the most information and the most accurate information the faster we can make better informed and logical decisions so just again hats off to our guys that are out here grinding day in day out like this is impossible without them and the hard work they do every day so.